There's an amazing amount of power in a small community. Enough power to move mountains. This community has helped me so much over the years. It has supported me through thick and thin. They've seen me through two Olympics. They've seen me through massive adversity, massive success. And so I feel really united with them. I noticed the power of our community when my dad died. This picture is a great picture of Emily and her dad. They had a great relationship. They played together, they laughed together, and he was her dad. They loved each other. He was the person who read the stories at the end of the day. Her dad worked at the hill, and so we, as a family we skied. July he was diagnosed with cancer, and then in September he died, so it was very fast. It's sad times. Emily was a huge support. She was 18 and uh, was strong even then. A lot of people really got behind Emily at that time saying, you know, she still has dreams she wants to fulfill. A lot of people in this community gathered together to, to help out. There was a family that really stepped in and made it possible for me to continue skiing. They realized that for us to continue with Emily skiing, we would have had a hard time. So they very generously gave some money and that took Emily through to the next level. We could help Emily with equipment, ski equipment, and also we could help her financially. We helped her to keep on racing. The community right away wanted to support Emily. Like They knew that it was a tough time for them financially and they helped to raise funds for her to continue with her career. And they've always been there. It's, I mean, Fern's a really strong community that way. Like, they come together when people are having hard times. Emily said to me one day that she would like to give back to the community, to this valley. She wanted to start a foundation. Total number of kids impacted by the foundation, 250. <laughs> Our mission statement essentially is that we will help youth in the Elk Valley with sports, arts and education. Our biggest programs are the ski and snowboard programs. She brings to a lot of kids, uh, brings them their dreams. It was for cup shots. The foundation has been a great supporter of Hallie, financially helping out uh, her going to some of her high-level camps. She's always putting out um, that everybody should have um, the right to do what they want. They should be able to achieve their goals and have dreams. And by having the foundation, you know, she's letting a lot of kids do that. She's been putting kids through ski programs, and summer programs, and anything they really want to pursue that they can't afford. We started with maybe 20 kids and now we're into the hundreds and so it's very exciting and I hope to continue more and more and continually give back to the community that gave me so much.